saw the dynamics of my reaction to the high table when I was introduced. Uh, the high table is made up of my very good friends, quote and unquote, uh, because you know I'm in the business of offending people through Sahara reporters. So I offend a lot of them all the time and I love some of them a lot of times. I am happy to be here with you today because this is the best time in Nigeria's history to be a young person. The reason is simple. The old people have outplayed their games and I, as a singer said in one of the reigning records that what you buy penalty or throwing, that is they play themselves out of uh, relevance. And, uh, We young people, and when I say young people, I'm not saying it as a sense of entitlement because there are a lot of young people in this country who are in a position of authority and they are useless. They are as useless as the old people. Some of them are governors, some of them are senators, House of Rep members. If you saw what happened at the Nigerian Senate yesterday, you will be very ashamed of this country. Let me shock you why you must guide your loins. The average life expectancy of a Nigerian person is only 50 something years old. That means if you were born in 1960, you should have been dead by now. That is the truth. This country is older technically than anybody that was born when they got independence in 1960. But the reason is simple. We have been blessed with really bad leaders, and I'm not ashamed to say it. And they traverse all facets of our institutional life, be it in the military, in the judiciary, in our businesses across this country. We are suffering and we have suffered, and our leadership has become bodysome. And he has said it, please give me a chance to finish. He has said it that some Nigerian young people are lazy. We are not lazy. Our problem is that we are governed by lazy people, lazy leaders. And we have a duty to send them packing and reclaim our country back when this country will be put on the right track of progress, prosperity, and development. This is not a campaign ground. This is a solidarity message. Take it back, young people. Take it back, young lawyers. Be prepared. By the way, by the way, young lawyers, be prepared for the job of being prosecutors to the Federal Republic of Nigeria because there's going to be a lot of prosecutions to be made over the destruction and the stealing of our national commonwealth. Thank you very much, Mr. President. Thank you, High Table.